Hey, hey, everyone. This is Steve here at the DJ Lab, and I have something important to share with you. Um, I did the update on my Denon DJ Go yesterday and um, went up to version 1.6.0, the official, and I was running the beta. So got the official, everything was looking good, and then I tried out a couple things and check this out. So now I'm back at the beta so I can demonstrate and show you how everything was working. So we got a track loaded up here. I'm gonna turn things up a little bit here. So this, on the sweep effect, watch this. Turn it all the way you can hit it and you have that nice echo out, right? Or go that way. And now, now listen to the effects though. Keep in mind the volume level that we're at right now. Applying a three quarter echo with full feedback. You notice how much that jumped up in volume, right? Let's turn that off. Halfway. And then when you take it off, so say you're halfway. So keep note of that. Now what I'm gonna do through the magic of uh, editing here, I'm going to take a couple seconds and I'm gonna go back to the new firmware and I'm gonna show you the difference. Okay, we now have it updated to the latest 1.6.0 and I'm gonna show you the difference of how this uh, doesn't work now. Ready? So the only way to make that effect work That's got to get fixed. But let me show you something that they did fix. Remember we had the uh, three quarter effect with the feedback in full. It doesn't seem to add as many uh, DB to everything, you know, and just send it out of whack. But yeah, so you managed to fix the effects over here that everybody was crying about, which is great. But uh, this one here, you got to fix because you can't have this. Just doesn't work. Anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, leave some comments below if you're having the same issue. I'm sure you are because if I'm having it, I bet we're all having it on the Prime Go. And uh, let's see if this is affecting the Prime 2 or the Prime 4. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you all soon.